and out. The Saints! His babies! Amazing win. Brilliant win from Port Adelaide. Ken Hinckley, take a bow. I'm so tired. I'm tired of getting into every game thread and seeing this same goddamn thing. Saints killed a heavy great young cow. The Saints are my second favorite team. The Saints will have it figured out in a few years. Guess this it is f***ing what? No, they f***ing what? They will turn it around. This is the saint. Kill the saints! There is no happiness here. We will not pull it out. We will leave it in there and the next thing you know, you're 33 years old with seven kids living in a 50s to a foot flat. Married to a semi-retired hawker from Frankston, getting blasted on Carlon Drake because your dad never taught you the Alkaitis in Traptis? Fuck you! I don't want to hear about how we don't have a winning culture. We haven't won a premiership since people stepped foot on the moon. to have that contest with Gunston pocket and Gunston collects it off hands this time Charlie Cameron did he get a toe on that it would coming. be a miracle goal one week later he's seen a lot of the football again oh, well no. on the handball no timed way. it brilliantly can he no top way. himself he can't top himself oh hush my mouth hush my mouth what a champion fucking <laughs> awesome Heaney gets it back. Oh, oh, a bullet. Oh. Sheather nearly bounced off his chest. Big moment for him. Comes up to Warner. Warner without warning. Out of nowhere. Five points to margin. 50 seconds and counting. Himmelberg takes it out of the air. Did he throw it away? Did he drop it then? Toby Green. He bends it. Toby did he get enough on it? He did. The Green Machine has done it again. Swans. Let's open these windows so the world can see your 24 point leap. <laughs> It's finally finished. A memoir of my life written in red ink. There's a big particles. Dig, dig, dig it, dig, dig it, dog. Quick and dig, dig, dig it, dig, dig it, dog. Hello, everybody. My name is Old Fossil. And welcome back to the Hawk's Nest. I've had to relocate due to the orange tsunami that completely destroyed our old home. Luckily I found this island that is free of rugby supporters. So hopefully, 
I can run a fucking show without being called gay for the millionth fucking time. I've been searching for this place for almost a fortnight, so let me check up on how the Hawks did last week. <laughs> Had plenty of effort. Lewis to Warple as he got the shape. Ah! Jump, 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 jump. <laughs> Only a brick wall could stop you. Its name is Tim O'Brien. Hello, Will Day. Back again to Seamus Mitchell. Missed one last week, came close. Oh! <laughs> okay, here we go. Focus. Speed. I am speed. This could be and it is Impy. Can they capitalize over Ramson Bruce? Claims it. And the return of Mitch Lewis. Yes! 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 So yes! And it's yes! Really getting bigger. No! 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 no. About Weddle is Jason. He has a basketball background. <laughs> and then Nash has had a rare kick. Rolling, 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 rolling. Day with the acrobatics and the flourish up the mark. The Hawks are coming. The dog's defense on guard. They needed to be good. I said, let against him on the come. ground. Much more comfortable. High for Lewis. Jeff got twisted and turned everywhere. This is painted after the umpire again went play on, play on, play on. That, that is really interesting, isn't it, when it's, that happens? It's overruling another umpire, isn't it? It is, because the closer umpire has made a decision, his yep. decision is play on. And you're saying that decision's wrong, mm. I'm going to play this decision. What's wrong with you, bro? What the heck? You tripping, bro. You tripping! <laughs> Do it! Just do it! times he's kicked a goal for Mission failed. We'll go next time. One goal so far today. Oh, let's go! That's class. <laughs> Quick answer is a good answer. Oh. How about that? I am boycotting AFL until they end the match fixing. I have a feeling that Gilly McLaughlin leaving is not going to stop the match fixing. I think it goes even deeper than that. I need everyone watching this to share this video around to all their friends and spread the message. Boycott the AFL. Do not go to games. Do not even watch games on TV. Until the AFL put a stop to the match fixing. They've freaking done it! Modern editing techniques we can give North Melbourne and West Coast a competitive Saturday night game. <laughs> Watch. The round seven from Optus Stadium on a Saturday night. Picture perfect night for footy. Just encouraging his players to be as competitive as they possibly can. Thanks, Linger. We're underway, Goldstein. <laughs> oh, brother, this guy stinks! Seamless, huh? You're fired. Hey, with good cards. Walsh. He's at the top of the square, Colonel. He's wanting it desperately. He leads into the pocket. Akers was going to go there. He decides instead to just give it some height. Send it. They're both down there. Colonel again. Directly in front for number nine. It's a big bag for the big blue bag. Here it goes in his direction yet again. Not at the second bite that time. Turno circling. Ion. Doherty looking. Just places it into the pocket. Barris a big thump. Margin at 90. The Blues moving it forward. They get the overlap run. Kennedy wants Kerno. Doubles back to the goal square. Kick in that direction. It's over his head. He's gone all the way himself. Charlie Kerno inside 50. Pushing, shoving, getting some space. But the kick went low to Mackay. Kerno was clear. He's on. They share it around. But in the space is Durden. Let me go. 108 points. The margin has 
with the West Coast Eagles. For the Country Festival game, and it's the two brothers against each other. The two twins, Brad Scott versus Chris Scott, were underway. Great to have your company. This brook thinks he's so good because you won a flag last year. I can't wait to kick your lungs ass and show them that I am a superior twin. I'm so proud of Brad. I'm so happy he got another chance at coaching. I can't wait to see him lead the Bombers to their first finals win. Siren sounds on a beautiful afternoon at the MCG. And the cream starting to rise to the top. Well, at least I'll always have the 2014 summer final. That should have been a boundary throwing. This is more fucking match fixing. Because the ball went out. Fucking I love this fucking shit. Fuck this fucking shit. It's a critical win for Gold Coast. The Suns with their third straight victory over Richmond. They remain within striking distance of the top eight. At three and four. Oh no, the sun is rising! <laughs> the mighty sun! If Pies win, my tips will be eight out of nine this week. So for the first and last time in my life, go the Pies! Now it's Noble! He's close enough! And he shuts up the crowd of the Allied Oval! Steel side bottom. Over the head of Dawson. They'll take smart, it behind. Smart. How clever was that by Johnson? Hoskin Elliott can kick a long ball. He it's sets up. it up. Is it side bottom or the skipper? Oh. It's side bottom. It's another most valuable behind. We've seen so many of them in the city of Churchill's. It's another Collingwood miracle. And we shouldn't be surprised. Absolutely, the Crows were robbed. Right in front of me. Right in front of me. I am a god. Dick, dick, diggity, dick, diggity, dog. Break it. A big shout out to Sharks Ray and Big Mac John, our tier 3 channel members, and I've got everybody else on screen as well, the tier 1 and tier 2. And if you want me to read your name out on screen, make sure you get around the tier 3 channel membership option. Uh, just hit the join button next to my channel name. The link's in the bio as well. Ciao.